Hello, hope everyone out there is doing great. So is it bell peppers for dinner tonight? Well, we picked them up from the store nice and crispy. Come back and cook them in the way we fancy. And it won't be an exaggeration to say that there can be hundred ways of making bell peppers. But what about these? Do we intend to throw them? Well, if you want to save some money, and if you are the kind who always wonders, you know what, I should grow my own bell pepper, then this is the right time. No great preparation needed for this task. All you have to do is let the moisture from the seeds dry up a bit and they are ready for planting. If the weather is already warm when you want to start it, you can directly sow it into the soil outdoors or if you want to start early, then before the last frost around your area, you can grow them indoors and bring it out when the sun warms up the weather. Now you can just draw a little line with your finger into the soil and I always tend to put two to three seeds in one hole. That's just insurance, just in case germination is not 100%, you ensure that there is still one seedling available for you in each hole. Also, you can grow them compact in case you intend to thin them or separate them later to different pots, raised beds or in ground. But in case you want to sow them directly into the permanent place where you want the plant to grow, then you need to keep a sizable amount of gap, say like at least 12 to 18 inches. Just one fourth inch deep for the seeds to go is good enough and once that is done, cover them with a thin layer of soil. And with the help of your palm, you can just step them like this into the ground so that the seeds are compact and they can do their job well of germinating. Give them a good drink of water and let them be. After two weeks, here is the magic. Almost all the seeds have germinated, but in case you want your seedlings to be a little more stronger, you can let them be for another week. So at the end of three weeks, this is how they're gonna look, stronger. So wasn't that easy? In less than three weeks time, what we have is ample amount of seedlings of bell peppers from just two bell peppers which we picked up from the store. So what are you waiting for? Go ahead, do this experiment and share your journey with us. But before that, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more such great tales. Till then, take care, bye-bye and have a great day.